In human form, however, and he's sitting right next to me. He's a television host. He's a husband. He's an all-around glorious I'm all around human everything. Being. Tom Sullivan. What's up? It's so good to be back. Hi. Wow, you guys haven't changed at all. <laughs> I love having you here. Every time you're here, you brighten everyone's day. And we Likewise, it. Every, the whole staff, the whole team, right here. It's yeah. so great to be back here. It is great. We were just chatting about birthdays and upcoming celebrations, and it's going to be a good. We're ending January, but February is going to be. It's going to be good. It is going to be good. I feel I feel good about where 2024 is going. Yeah, and, I, and I have a new job. I'm on the air now afternoons on uh, Fox FM, which is all 70s, 80s, and 90s, 102.1 FM here in Atlanta. And I'm on every day, 4 to 7 now. Oh, nice. So I'll be giving you guys shouts out on okay. the air. Okay, would you please? That Absolutely. would be nice. That's yeah. a lot of hours a day. But I, I prefer, do you have a favorite decade of music? Let us know on our Facebook page. Oh, yes. I feel like mine is probably the 80s. Okay, that's one of the most successful decades of music ever. Okay. Of any genre, and I love the okay. '70s. I, I'm a '70s guy, and I okay. love the '70s. But we play a whole bunch of great '80s everything. all the time. Okay, I um, I'll be tuning in to listen to that. But I I'm glad that you're here today because I actually so one of my dear friends. I've known him for 20 years. Mm -hmm. His name's Kevin Wanzer, and he texted me the other day. His mom is going through dementia. Mm -hmm. It's been such a shift um, in his daily life. And you know, when mm -hmm. your your parent gets sick, then everything kind of goes to your parent to take care of them. And um, his mother moved to Indianapolis, where he's from. And he's just, he's an inspirational comedian and motivational speaker. He's just the nicest guy. He kind of like right. personifies kindness. And so he wanted to do this for his mom, have people send cards to her. But let's watch them in a quick video time. Okay, if you'll cool. indulge me, let's cool. watch this. Uh, hi, Atlanta and company. My name is Kevin, and this is my beautiful mother, Mickey. Mickey. And Mickey just moved to uh, be near us in Indianapolis so we can help care for her as she starts this new journey of life. And she said she's afraid that no one's ever going to know she's here and that she's never going to get mail. So I've invited people to send beautiful cards her way, and they're starting to come in. So if you would love to be part of that... <laughs> be joy to her life, that would be great. But the challenge uh, from us to you is this. If there's someone special in your life that you know would love to hear from you, please, please, please take a moment, buy them a card, and send them a message of love as well. And so, put money in my cards. That would be nice <laughs> do too. not put money in the yeah, cards, Mom. Lots of money. Okay, that's not part of this. We love you, Kara. Bye, Atlanta. Don't send money. Yeah. Oh, that's so great. And there's Mickey enjoying her new surroundings and just surrounded also by the love of Kevin. And he has a challenge, hashtag um, choose to love, the choose to love challenge, hashtag choose to love challenge. You can go on his website, kevinwanzer.com, and it's all the information is right there. So you can send a card to his mom. And he said she truly gets so, so excited to receive uh, all the cards. I've got some great pop-up cards. I I'm going to send her yes, one of those. Same. She'd love it. I'm going to yes. send one too. Uh, what a great story. I yes, love that. I love that. So we're thinking about you, Kevin and Mickey. Yeah. All right. And on that kind of feel good vibe, Mm -hmm. uh, you know, we've had a lot of rain here recently, yes. and uh, not to mention cold weather, but in Louisiana, floods, and uh, if you're driving a school bus, mm -hmm. you may have a hard time getting through the heavy rain. Well, uh, recently, a grandmother, uh, her daughter was getting oh. off the bus, and so uh, Gail Noble, who is the school bus driver, went the extra mile and actually took the child, put the child on the back, and oh. then she carried her through the high waters to the grandmother, who was waiting to pick her up and she took a photo of this and the school uh, you know director of the uh, uh, educational area there said yes. wow you know thoughtfulness and love for our children really is exemplified by her great actions there oh wow Tom I love that story bus drivers are just everyday heroes and oh mrs. white we love mrs. white and I love that story too okay we have time to get to the next one so okay great great because you you're all about you know in a state okay sale. I, I do okay yeah. now 30 years ago uh, Harriet lost her wedding photos she was moving she couldn't find them so this woman named Sandra goes to an auction which we all love getting a deal and she saw these beautiful wedding photos and these frames and go you know what someone would really love to get these back so she posted to social media and there's Harriet who got the uh, wedding photos returned through the kindness of others on Facebook tracked her down and they mailed the photos back to her and she was overjoyed oh. of getting them and look at that <gasps> Yeah, she'd be, she didn't look I 85, does she? That. No, well, she she's in great phenomenal. shape. Oh, 
my gosh, that's so exciting. How, what a great day for her to get those back in the mail. I know, They're beautifully I know. framed. I was too. doing an estate sale once and I found uh, a wedding album for the family and I wrapped it up and gave it to them on Christmas. It was uh, like a couple of weeks later and they were just J James Bradford uh, oh. and his wife Maud. And so they were so happy to get it back. Tom, I love that. Such yeah. good stories. And you're going to be back in a few days. And yes. thank you for letting me share Kevin's video. You guys very much remind me of one another. You're both just lights and so Yeah, kind, I loved right? him. I yes. loved, I, I'm yeah. definitely uh -huh. going to go to his website. Yeah. All right, Tom. Thank you so much for Thanks, being Kara. here. And I'll see you on Thursday. You're the you best. All right. Coming up, a hot